Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. In today's tutorial, guys, I'll be showing you how to add on iOS 14 the calendar widget. So in case you want the calendar widget as a part of your main widgets, so we're going to go ahead and show you how to do this. So go ahead and scroll over until you find a blank space. Then you can do one of two things. Either press and hold the blank space, you'll get the app jiggle. And the way to get the app jiggle would be to long press on any app, hold, keep holding, and you'll get the jiggle. Or of course, you could um, go ahead, long press for a little while, let go. And of course, hit edit home screen. All of these will take you to the app jiggle. Then you can hit the plus in the upper left. And of course, once you're here, you should be able to find the calendar widget. So you're gonna go ahead and scroll down. Once you go down, the calendar is somewhere up here. As you can see, the calendar is right there. You can tap there, or of course, you can go down here and select calendar. Next thing you gotta do guys is tap the calendar. You're gonna have the options. Now this is showing the um, current date. And of course it says no more events. If you add events, they'll show up here. This is the small. You also have the medium and of course the large. The large is gonna take up a lot of space. Um, I like the medium, it's very nice. Small is very small. So I'm gonna choose this one. Then you're gonna hit add widget. Once you do, you can hold, tap and hold to move the widget around. Of course, guys, you can uh, move. If you want to go over to another um, page, simply hold and move over. Simply hold and you can move. You can move it all the way to the main screen. If you so choose, you can even move over to create new tabs or new home screens. All right, so we're going to place it right here. And of course, once I'm satisfied, I can hit done. That's it. You'll now have the calendar widget. Notice it highlights the current date. All right. You can also edit the widget. So go ahead and press and hold and hit edit widget. And of course, once you do, you'll have the option if you want it to mirror your calendar app, meaning the one on the phone. So it will pull stuff from that. If you want to stop it from taking stuff from your um, calendar app, go ahead and turn this off. In my case, it's fine. So I'm going to leave it as is. I'm going to stop and that's it. If you want to remove it, guys, go ahead and long press and hit remove widget. And it's going to ask you to confirm. Go ahead and hit um, remove when you're ready. If not, go ahead and hit cancel. All right. And so that's how you add the calendar widget to your device. All right. We're going to have a block tip. Same bye until next time. Bye.